Online strategist John Lawler here. I'd like to talk to you about spinning headlines. So what do we mean by spinning headlines? Let's say you're looking to do a new blog post and you'd like it to be relevant to your industry. And one good way of doing it is to go out and see what's in the news. So what I've done here is I've gone out to uh, Google News and I've gone to the New York Times as my source and I'm looking for terms that relate to online marketing. And I pick the term, the, the month, the current month that we're in. So I found one that I think could provide some compelling interest, which is a pitch battle over bed bugs in online search advertising. So I'm going to copy that. I'm going to come over here and I'm going to open a program called The Best Spinner, which it, by its name, you might work by be able to ascertain that it's about spinning words into other words, spinning headlines into other headlines. It was really made to spin mainly articles, full articles, but I like to use it for short things like headlines. So what I'm going to do is I just go through and I use the um, tab key and it brings up synonyms for me. And a new, okay, a new is a little different, pitched and important could be um, a f important pitch battle, a a real pitch battle. Okay, those are pretty good. So I'm going to now go to the next word and pitched battle. There, there's only the suggestion engine is only coming up with two words. I don't like either one. Um, let's say uh, let's say it's a violent violent battle. I can just add it add it in there, and now it comes in, and I'm going to go to the next word. Battle, okay. Fight, struggle, combat, challenge, conflict, showdown, campaign. That's enough. I'm going to go to the next one, which is over. Um, I'm not going to worry about that one. Bed bugs, bed bugs, okay. Bed bugs. Um, two ways of putting it in online search on the, let's see, in internet, online, web web-based search advertising, um, internet-based, web-based. Okay, there are a few ways of looking at it. Search advertising. I'm not going to change search. I'm going to keep search the way it is, and I'm going to add in marketing. Add it in, and base. Marketing. Okay, a little error there. I clicked too quickly. Okay, so now we have what is, it doesn't really make a lot of sense here, but it's basically um, a uh, spun piece. And the nice thing about this program is all I have to do is come over here and I can generate spun headlines, or as they call it, articles. And I'm going to generate, to begin with, I'm just going to generate 10. And I'm going to use a separator, meaning it's going to go through and it's going to create lots of articles, 10 articles specifically, based on our 10 headlines, based on this. It's going to ask me for um, a, uh, I'm going to call it headline bugs. And it's version one. Oh, because there's 10 of them. Okay, now it's all done. It's created it. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to come over to uh, Microsoft Word and I'm going to open that file, Bugs 1.0. We have a pitched battle over bed bugs. Is the original one in online search advertising a new violent fight over bed bugs in internet search marketing? Okay, could be compelling. An important violent struggle over bed bugs in web based search advertising. These are all good titles that you could use in a blog post or you could use, let's say, if you're bookmarking the article and you want to have it out and you need to have different different versions of it. Okay, so let's just quickly go back here to uh, to the uh, best spinner, and I'm going to now tell it I want 30 of them. Same deal. Give it a give it a title. Uh, let me give this one 30, and now I'm done. I go back to Word, and I'm going to open headline bugs 30. Move it over into the screen, and now you see that we have a whole bunch of them here. We have 30. This is online strategist John Lawler. I want to thank you for watching. I hope this video has been beneficial. If you'd like more information, please follow the link on the screen.